Hi, from this video, I am going to show you how to use an IR proximity sensor with the Arduino. I will show you how the sensor is working and how to operate various devices with it. This tutorial will include the circuit diagrams and required source codes for the project. So before going to the tutorial, I invite you to subscribe my channel and click the bell icon to get the future videos like this. Now let's take a look into the sensor. This clear LED is an infrared emitter which emits IR signals. When it hits an object, it will bounce back and detects by this black color IR receiver. It can detect objects within 2 to 60 cm. We can adjust the sensitivity of this sensor by rotating this potentiometer. Let's connect this sensor with the Arduino board. Take three male to female jumper wires and connect them with the sensor. First, connect the VCC pin of sensor with the 5V pin of Arduino. Next, connect the ground pin of the sensor with the ground pin of the Arduino. Finally, connect the out pin with digital pin 2 of Arduino. Then take a 5V active buzzer and connect two male to female jumper wires with it. Connect positive pin with digital pin 8 of Arduino. Connect the negative pin of the buzzer with the ground pin of the Arduino. Next, plug the Arduino board to the computer using an USB cable. You will see this power LED is indicating. The other LED is obstacle detection LED. We can use it to adjust the sensitivity of the module. To do this calibration, put an object in front of the sensor in required distance. I will put this object in few centimeters away from the sensor. Then I will turn this potentiometer into the exact place where the object LED starts to on. Then remove the object and observe the obstacle LED. It should turn off. Then place the object again in the same location. Then it should turn on again. Now we have calibrated the sensor to use in a project. Now download and open this code named Arduino IR Obstacle Sensor. In first two lines, it has declared the pins which IR sensor and buzzer have connected. Now let's come into the setup function. From this line, it has started the serial communication at the speed of 9600 baud rate. From this line, it has declared the IR sensor as an input device for the Arduino. From next line, it has declared the buzzer as an output device for Arduino. Now let's come to the loop function which runs again and again. From this line, it reads the digital input from the IR sensor and saves it in a variable called sensor status. From this if condition, it checks the sensor's digital state. These types of IR sensors will output a low signal when an object is detected. When there is no any object, it will output a high signal. So if the sensor outputs a low signal, it will check that from this if condition and execute these two lines.
from this line, it will turn on the buzzer. This line will print an object is detected message on the serial monitor. If sensor status is 1, it will execute this else part. This will turn off the buzzer while printing no objects were detected message on serial monitor. This line will put a delay of 500 milliseconds before going to the next cycle. Now let's upload the code into the Arduino board. If you are a beginner for Arduino programming and don't know how to upload codes for the Arduino board, please watch my previous tutorial called Arduino Tutorial for Beginners. I will put its link in the video description. Ok, now keep an object in front of the sensor and observe. Yes, you can see that it will turn on the buzzer when we keep the object near sensor. And it will turn off when we take it away. At the same time, open the serial monitor and observe the text on it. It also shows the relevant state of the sensor. We can modify this basic code to do various things. If you want to run motors or any other electrical appliances from this IR sensor, you can use a relay module instead of this buzzer. I have created a very detailed tutorial about the way of using a relays with Arduinos. Please watch it and get an idea about it. I will put its link in the video description. This is the way of using an IR proximity sensor with Arduino. Don't forget to subscribe my channel to see my future videos like this.